Hey guys, welcome back to PC911. Uh, what we're going to be doing here today on this unit is an HP. It's a little uh, banged up. Uh, it's running Windows 8. We're going to upgrade, wipe everything out. We're going to install a fresh Windows 10, but we are going to virus proof this baby. Yes. We're going to install Linux Ubuntu on it. We're going to have a dual boot. Uh, computer's going to boot up as the, uh, the primary operating system will be Linux, and then secondary uh, will be uh, the Windows 10. Uh, we already ran a test on it, and a lot of the newer HPs are running a uh, Wi-Fi chipset or a Wi-Fi driver that's not very compatible. So this little guy right here, we're going to swap that out and uh, put a Linux compatible one, and then we should be good to go. I'll uh, show you how it goes. Thanks for watching. Hey guys, so here we are back with the, uh, the HP. We got both operating systems installed. We got Linux installed on there. And we got uh, Windows 10. Let me show you how that boots up. You got the two operating systems right there. And basically just gives you the option here to choose. Let's go uh, into the Linux. Just hit enter. And actually, right next to it, we got another unit that we're doing the same exact thing. Windows 10 with uh, with Linux Ubuntu on it as well. This is booting up and going to bring us up to the desktop over here. Very simple. Uh, again, you've seen some of the other videos. You're going to be running your uh, Chrome and your Firefox for all your uh, for all your web content. We also have included here Kodi on here. So uh, the Movie Box, the Kodi Pie Box, basically that software is built in here. So this thing's ready to go. I'm going to do a quick pause, do a restart, uh, and show you if you want to go into your windows we just basically do a restart right here I'm gonna just let it run through so you can see kinda how it works it doesn't take too long to boot up and we're gonna be back on that purple screen again bada boom you're right there and we're gonna drop down with a keyboard so like the Windows 10 gives this little funky screen there and boom there you go so we got ourselves or not we got ourselves this customer's got himself a virus proof computer he still has got windows if he needs the software but when he surfs on the internet he doesn't have to worry about viruses malware doesn't have to worry about emails opening them doesn't have to worry about ransomware he is good to go so if you got uh, 